Hi, this is Sherry Veronica. We have to start a conversation about how heavy handed the authorities can be with certain members of the Barbadian society and then others can get away with just about anything. With me in studio is Patricia Benedict and we want to talk about Henderson Payne, someone who has allegedly taken one Guinness one Guinness out of the Massey store and we're hearing that he is up in St. Philip for six months. One Guinness costs $3.25. $3.25. So he is spending, we are hearing, six months, six months behind bars for stealing something that was $3.25. And other people have been complained about, have done so much worse and they are walking the streets of Barbados. So let's talk about what's happening in Barbados and how poor people seem to be disadvantaged. Not only poor people, but certain poor people because other poor people seem to be getting away with murder also. Patricia, welcome into the studio. Yes, thank you for having me, Ms. Veronica. You're I'm welcome. Not, I'm really upset about that. And it's Henderson um, Payne, a.k.a. Arab, because they wouldn't know him by his name. They wouldn't know him more as Arab. Okay, Arab. Okay. Um, it, do you remember the 25th of May when I, I'm sorry, September, when I said to you all, I saw um, 677 Williams and he, and at 5 past 8 p.m. and then Henderson Payne was sitting down um, in the, um, by Massey, but inside the president of Massey and he asked Henderson if he was okay. And the same time Sluggy, um, um, David Small was, I heard he tell somebody in Massey, yes, sir, and went out through the exit door with stuff. I don't know if he paid for it or not. And then, then at the Tuesday, the Tuesday, which was the 26th, I heard people were saying that Henderson Payne, a.k.a. Arab, got arrested for a Guinness. So I, I you know, which I, I'm actually sitting um, around the area. Today is the 27th. And I, I, you know, I started doing investigations, asking different people, and they said, well, he drank, some people said, for because he had one in his pants, and um, he drank one, allegedly. But everybody is saying that that's what happened. But Miss Veronica, I was made to understand he went through, if you don't forget, Magistrate Wayne Clark is back, he's presiding judge, he's back. And Ms. Ms. Veronica, I heard people were saying, allegedly, that Mr. Henderson Payne, a.k.a. Arab, was sent to prison for six months for drinking that Guinness. Now, I have a lot of problems with that, Ms. Veronica. One, there are too many police, and I've told the AG that the commissioner and the prime minister, the too many policemen moonlighting in Massey. Two, you have, you have to investigate to find out who was the person that come and, and, and charge you because you know the police, they, when you're moonlighting, you cannot, you cannot charge, you, you cannot charge uh, somebody. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ms. Renica, I just came from the station because you know I had a statement against Sluggy. And you know that same Citizen Sergeant, I saw you, Citizen Sergeant told me that he he was charged and he wasn't charged. Then the same Sluggy, Miss Veronica, the lady that had the stall opposite um um the medical center is since been putting down Sluggy stole all her snacks and her drinks. Yeah, but he was arrested and for then, that. He was arrested for that. He went up for that. Allegedly, because you still don't know. Because remember, I told you yesterday what they do with Sluggy like is hide him in the police station, or they toy, or they or they tell him to to keep a uh, uh, keep um a low, keep it low, right? So allegedly, they say he was arrested. But even if that's the case, so two three weeks after you seen Sluggy like walking around. And you know how much money that the, the, the woman was out? Because when I asked her, she told me the prosecutor never called her. The prosecutor never called her to tell her, well, they, they had um, slug in custody. And she says she's still out of pocket. 
So you charging from somebody for one Guinness, two twenty five, and it's like it's so, no, so many no, things. No, no, but but he could, and wait, I just I was just okay, talking to another Jesus. guy there who said to me, okay, wait one second. To the he th yeah. he took two. He took two. You, he he drank one and he had one in his in his pants. So he actually his stole pants, allegedly. So yeah, yeah. So he stole two. Whether whether he drank all two or not, that's not the, the matter. Is he took two Guinness? He he drank. Well, he consumed. Mm. He consumed one and he had one that he was mm. that they, that they took back to the store where I don't know what they would do with it. But he yeah. stole he stole two Guinnesses and they were three dollars and twenty five cents each. And he's, yes. he's, but but I've I've known and I've written and I've blogged about people who were around the garrison, yeah, not the garrison, mm -hmm. the, the oval, the Kensington oval, who were taking up bottles, yeah. empty bottles, and they they went up to Dawes for trespassing, so they know what to do with certain mm -hmm. people. It seems as though they pick on certain people, and then other people can do just about anything, and they're protected. But, but because Sluggy works for them, but let me tell you something else. A guy was just telling me that, I'm still around the area in Massey, where Sluggy, he, he, um, Sluggy stole $34 from him, a, a, a friend of his. The friend said he went to the police station and was one a complaint for Sluggy. The police officer gave the, the guy the $34 and told the guy that Sluggy is one of us. Okay, so Sluggy has Sluggy has a worth for the police. They need him on the beach. They need him on the street. They need his ears. They need his eyes. So he's working for them. Yes. So so he, he's val for, for there's a value to him. He may be an irritant to you, but he seems to be a value to law enforcement to law enforcement because he's the eyes and the ears to other people right right and that's why they, why why when the people come and in comments and talk nonsense about, uh, know, they say that sluggy um there is, you know everybody in everybody in santa Cruz know who sluggy is and everybody knows he works with the police but that should not be and then come to find out too he was never charged for my my this when Sister Sergeant Lynch told me he was charged before the court, I went to the club just now. Today is the twenty seventh. Are you still in my clothes? They told me there's no matter before the court. I was before the court pertaining to Sluggy. So mm. they will they are going to great lengths to 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 protect him. And I won't be surprised if if he was the one that thing um um uh, Arab. There's more to it. I, Mr. Williams, know be because. Because when in 2021, there was something that was in my phone when Liko um, had me um, thing. But 2021, there was something that Arab, I did an interview with Arab, and that Liko must have gotten hold of that. And since then, I see that Arab needs help. What magistrate Wayne Clark should have done, and everybody knows that, should have sent him to the mental for 28 days. He needs help. There's something wrong with him. He loses his memory. There's a lot of things wrong with him, but he, he needs mental evaluation because he needs the help. Well, he's not going to get the help. Henderson Payne is not going to get the help. Henderson Payne is not someone that they're going to spend money on. They're going to spend psychiatrists, psychologists, counselors on. He, he's not going to get that help. He's someone that will go up in doors and, and take up a seat and justify why they no, need... No, 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 Miss Veronica. No, no, no. Not only take up a seat. No, 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 no. You, 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 you see, and that's why people comment and they don't... I've been dealing that down there for 2017. You never know if it, you will, if, if if Henderson Payne stays in there, he will be deceased. And but, a lot of things I can't tell you. All. But how do they justify having having the guards at at doors and having people work? They have to have inmates, and he, that's that's all he's doing. He's he's just he's just making up a number. They don't care. They don't care if he lives or dies. They don't. I don't think they care about something like that when it comes to Henderson Payne, also known as. Yes, Veronica Henderson Payne works with the same Henderson Payne works for the, the, the police. And Tina Papasino and the organization. Oh Jesus. Okay. So there's something that must have happened where they wanted him. You mean where they wanted him gone? Yes. The law things I cannot share with you, Miss Veronica. So it doesn't make so so they, they so if there are things you cannot say, you should still you should still say things to make an uh, interview sound 
No, 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 Miss. No, 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 no. I, make, I don't have to say anything to make an interview, Tom, because his, his life will still be in danger up there. Because when he did that, did an interview with me, mm -hmm. it put, and then Lee Cock would have gotten hold of that. And remember, he had told you he, he had access to my phone. He took my phone. Yes. And Mr. Williams would know exactly which one it is. Since then, and that's how Henderson. That's why Henderson got got, got got You know, you see how he he like he turns. I don't know what's the word for it. Since then, uh, like I had my phone, Mr. Veronica, Miss Veronica, I mean, Mr. Veronica. <laughs> Henderson was never the same. Mm. And I know exactly, Mr. If I tell Miss Mr. Mr. William, know exactly what I'm talking about. With our deputy commissioner knows what I'm talking about. Okay. And they have to protect him up there. He needs to come out, and he needs um, he needs to be in the mental. Okay. He's not gonna. He's not gonna last long up there. Okay. For one Guinness, Magistrate Wayne Clark. For one Guinness. No, no, they're actually two. Just, they're actually two. Because if you steal, if you steal two, it doesn't matter if you drank all two or not. You he stole two. Two. That's why. That's why I told you. And one more thing. That's why I told you, AG, right? Mm -hmm. Um, Miss Miss Harriet. You know what we said her name was. Is doing um the lady that was there before Miss Miss um Miss Angela Knight was a very fair magistrate, but the prosecutors did not like that because what when they put her the because the AG she was there on the government behalf she told me they were stopped from making money. That's why they wanted Magistrate Wayne Clark back there. Okay, a lot of things people and, and people. Um, and Tina Pabas, you know, all of them commenting and all those people, let me just tell you one thing all those people that's commenting negatively is part of the organization with Tina and them well, we know, that, is, that is no one of them that is no that, 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 that is no, no one does anything in Barbados unless they're, they're told to do it we, that is no, okay so he, he stole two drinks okay, and he is up there for six months for six dollars and fifty cents. Six dollars and fifty cents cost him a half a year of his life. His name is Henderson Payne. Uh, Henderson Henderson and you gonna find out how how much Ricky Ricky, Ricky what's the guy name yesterday? Because it was a job bad wife Jordan, you gonna find out how, how much months he get to? That who, should be investigated too. Who, who's Ricky? That's kind of lawless you remember the guy yesterday you we featured? Oh, okay. I was the one. But that's, that's Jordan. That's Jordan. No, I was the one. That's yeah. Jordan Supermarket. That's Jordan Supermarket. Right. His name they, is Ricky they Small. Have to look at that matter too, and how much time matters. Even if you plead guilty, you, you can. Even if you plead guilty, you should have an option of of um personal bail. Look at um the Henderson Collins. If, if, if you plead you guilty, me, if, he gets fish and beer, but if you, if, you, beer. if you plead guilty, they can sentence you right away for something like that. For something like this, two Guinness, and you plead guilty. And you know these officers work for Massey, where he, he sold the he sold those Guinnesses yes. for Massey. He can, he's going to he, bail. Why would he get bail? It's so it's 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 it's, it's, it's clean. It's, it's it's a closed matter. And you don't need any sentencing structure. I think it's it's a bench matter. It's not jury. You don't need a jury to convene. Miss, Miss Veronica, yes. you're missing the point, though. No, I'm not missing they the point. I, I'm, no, I'm not missing the point. No, I'm not missing the point. No, I'm not missing the point. I'm not missing the point. The point. The point is that they don't care about Henderson. They don't care about Henderson Payne. They don't care about him. He stole two Guinness from their employers because they're moonlight at, at protecting mm -hmm. and security at Massey. And Ma what Massey says goes. And they, they, they got rid of exactly. him for six months. For six months. Okay. And who knows him if he's on good behavior. He may come out before six months. In four months. Mr. Veronica, he may not they put him there because he ain't going to come out. Okay. Okay. So we should. If we'll, come, if, 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 no, because they have to remove him from okay, the so hopefully, I'm about, you yeah, so hopefully you and I hopefully you and I will be around in four months and we can re, we can pick up from here and see if he's dead or alive in the meanwhile we still have this um Ricky small who took all that stuff from Jordan's supermarket and he talked about a conscience having a conscience so we will see how long mm -hmm. he sent he sent it for because if Henderson Payne went up for six months for six dollars this guy um, small Ricky Small should probably go up for like twenty years. <laughs> twenty years. So basically, and that should not happen. But you see, what now? Let me bring and 
bring bring it home to you. You see that that Rick is, Rick is small. I I when I was the one when he was in in there that he he turned himself in. Now how had I not that not had not happened? They hide the people in prison, and that is so, that is what. So we should see. That's what going so, we, so so people Barbadians have to keep their eyes open to see if hint F um Ricky Small is on the street within the next couple of days. You have to keep your eyes open for that because it's obvious that I understand that, but this is not what I'm telling you. What are you saying? I'm telling you, what I'm saying to you is that had if I had not think about the Ricky Small incident. They would have put him in prison if because Jordan's supermarket. They would have put him in prison and no one would have known about it. And that's why the 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 the, 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 the media only cover what they want to cover. Okay, so your, po your, but your point your, your point your point your point will only make sense if you say they will put him in prison for twenty years and no one will know about it. That that will make sense, but when you say they will put him in prison, that is not really making a point because they could put him in prison for two oh, days yeah, for a very long time, and nobody knows what went on. Or, or okay, so okay, he, he no okay. Access, no access to the people because you remember what they did to me up there, Miss Renegade. Yes, they, they they removed me from the database. So so when they look at me in the computer, I was not inmate in there. That's what I'm trying to explain to you. No, you weren't trying to explain. No, 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 no. Everyone that's listened to this interview wouldn't think that that's what you're trying to explain to me. But go ahead. When you have to find out too, because when if you look up somebody in the, the database, a lot of people go missing from the database. Okay. Because the the, the, the 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 guards and the police do not want them to be found. Okay. Okay. So the, those two matters, I am not condoning what Ricky, the other guy, did. But right. Uh oh, he out of it. But when 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 are they? If you do that for one, you should do it for the white person or the Canadian or whatever. They don't. Exactly. exactly. It's something for something. And that's why I totally aged magistrate. And I'm going to be talking about magistrate. I have Patricia Benedict notes, Miss Veronica, on, mm -hmm. on, 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 on a lot of notes of magistrate Wenklad, what he did wrong. Okay. And the apple doesn't fall from the same, the tree, the chief magistrate Ian Wicks. Okay. Yeah. So that madness got to stop you, can I mean, I, I, you, you could charge somebody, but I mean, six months. That's what they do. That, that's what that's what they do. To, I know for fact it needs help. That is what they do to poor people in Barbados. That is what they do. This is nothing new. Hey. Yeah, this is nothing new. But uh, we, uh, we, we, but we have to. The 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 the, the, AG, the commissioner and and them have to. To, to investigate the, the, those the, two the, the attorney general doesn't work in Bar the I mean, attorney general the attorney general doesn't do any work that kind of work in Barbie. he just he just sits in the seat and talks every now and again he doesn't do anything like no, that no 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 miss mm. you know I, I i beg to differ right okay when it comes to miss benedict case not only my cases you know only my cases you know when I tell Mr. Retired Commissioner Aaron Williams what, what what's going on in the whole town with the magistrates mm -hmm. and the that's why right now so right now as we speak, when I went to the clerk's office, there's somebody monitoring the clerks and that's the AG's department. So I it, as much as I, 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 I sometimes think them when we report retired commissioner Aaron Williams reports certain things to them, they take action. He doesn't just sit down. I don't know if the other places, but, but, but the other people observers watching them, so they don't they don't sit down. Yeah, I, I, and and I beg to, and I, I beg and I and I and I, and I beg and I beg to differ. I think they just sit down and then they only move when somebody like you is speaking and making a whole lot of noise and com and complaining to other you know people within the the structure there. I think they do like you just said. They don't just sit down and I I believe that they do just sit down and only move mm -hmm. when there's someone like you causing waves. So we, we are differing. You you said you I, said I one, one way I and I said. I have told the, the U.S. Embassy, the British Embassy, Canadian Consulate, Internal Affairs, Interpol, where to come to to think your your site naked departure, not only for my stories, for everybody you they, you put you every story you put there, they watch. But there are not many people every, like you. But there are not many people like Patricia Benedict. 
a lot of people are afraid. I know. I know, but I, I, I was never afraid. I grew up in St. Lucia. I was never afraid. I was Bajan born, but I was never, I was never. I was never someone to see something, especially to people that can do not, you know. I, I have a, I have a good, a good heart. I don't, I have no conflict of age, um, no conflict of interest. It could be BLP, DLP, SLP, whatever. It doesn't matter to me. If you do something wrong, I will tell the public. But nobody can tell me that this person did this and this person do that. Government do this and government. Government, government is a lot of a, a big body, you know. But we got we, we got to see what happens to okay. the small matter uh -huh. and, yeah. and the especially the the um Henderson um pain uh, matter. And he needs he needs to be in. He needs to be in Black Rock, the okay. mental. He yes. needs help. Yes, okay. Because he will not last maybe in there, Mr. Maybe, yeah, maybe someone will hear your words and hear your passion, and this would um, they could work on that on the back end to get him out of um, St. Philip and take oh, him yes. to Black Rock. The, yeah, see what happens. Like I said to you, there, there's much more like that information I got, and I cannot share with you oh, okay. or the public. Okay. But thank you so much for having me. I hope that I get resolved. <laughs> me too. Possible. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> thank yes. you. This is Sherry Veronica, Naked Departure Radio.